Praise the Lord, what should be protected? Because Psalms 121, 7 and 8 says, Psalms 127, 7 and 8 says, The Lord guards you from every evil. He guards your life. The Lord guards you as you come and go, now and forever. God is God. Uh, the Lord is guarding us. It's true. But certain things we have to protect at God. There are eight things that we have to protect. First thing is our time. Second thing is our health, our purity, our fellowship with God, our family and the friends, our good name, our money and possession, our eternal rewards. Even God is telling in one talk, Psalms 121, 7 and 8, He is guarding us, our body and our soul. But in, as our, we are in this world, we have to protect the eight things that is our duty so let us see how we have to protect the time why we have to protect the time so our, our Ephesians 5 16 says um, make the most opportunity because um, of the time because the, uh, the the days are very evil so don't be foolish but understand what the Lord wants them um, so always um, use the time opportunities correctly and do what God wants them um, because the days are evil so you have to protect your time once you waste the time it is not going to return back to you so next one is your Help them. That is Proverbs 5 11 to 13 says, um, Then you groan uh, when your end comes, um, when your body and flesh are consumed, um, you will say, Oh, how I hated the discipline, how my heart despised correction. So, um, if uh, God is giving you, our people, our parents, or, or our elderly people are disciplining you, are correcting you, just obey it. Otherwise, in future, you have to lose your health. Um, so you have to take care of your health. Nowadays, the health issue is the greatest problem. So first thing is you have to um, uh, protect your time. Second thing is you have to protect your health. Um, third thing is you have to protect your purity. That's what it, it is written in uh, Proverbs 6.26. Um, uh, do not desire her um, in your heart. Do not let her catch your eye with her eyes. Um, so that is what is important. Uh, don't see anything with the lustful eyes um, because um, when you see the person with the lustful eyes, it corrupt your heart. Um, so you have to uh, protect your purity. Third one. Fourth one, you have to protect your fellowship with the God um, because um, uh, Isaiah 59 and one and two says the Lord is not too weak to save or his ears are too deaf to hear but the problem is what but you are wrong have separated you from your God and your sins have made him hide his face so that he does not hear you the problem is our, we don't have a good fellowship with the God and immediately when the problem comes we go and pray unto the God without removing our um, uh, <clears throat> sin and um, um, uh, without remo removing our sin because the, the wrong things um, are the sin separate us from the God and hide our face um, from the God so he cannot answer our prayer. So you should have a good fellowship with the God. You have to protect your fellowship with the God. Fifth thing you have to protect is your family and friends. That is very, very important. How can you protect your family and friends? Um, because um, a devious people spread quarrels. Um, a gossip separates the closest of friends. Um, so don't allow this devious people or people who, who talk gossiping. So if you allow them in your home to talk to them, they will certainly destroy our family and friends. So you have to protect your family and friends. Um, sixth thing you have to protect is our, your good name. That is very, very important. Um, that's what Proverbs 22 one says. Um, um, a good name is more desirable than great wealth. Um, respect is better than silver or gold. So your good name, instead of um, getting the wealth, um, silver, gold, land, um, it's needed. It's okay. But beyond that, your good name is more desirable. If somebody tell your name, they should have to tell you are good. You are, you are a righteous man. You are a faithful man. They should not tell you are a deceiver. You are a a person who always lustful and wrongdoer. So that is very bad. So you have to protect your name. Seventh thing you have to do is um, you have to protect your money and possession. Proverbs 11, 16 says um, a gracious woman wins respect. Um, a ruthful man um, gains riches. That is what is important. God gives the blessing of riches and possession. We have to protect it. We should not lose it um, uh, by using it in the wrong way. Eighth thing is our eternal reward. That is very important. Revelation 3, 11 says, um, I am coming soon. Hold on to what you have so that no one takes your crown. The God is going to come very soon. But during before that time the hardship is coming during this hardship um, don't um, uh, don't uh, uh, don't allow your uh, satan to take away your crown because uh, god is going to come and give the crown for you so don't allow uh, the situation the uh, problems um, even the lustful uh, thing of the world uh, allow you to take that crown away from you so th th these eight things we have to protect them um, we have to 
take one character the bible that that name is that man's name is noah he has them we have to protect eight characters and the same thing the eight things noah has protected them um, that's what um, his name was included um, in the faith li- faith list in hebrews chapter 11 let us see how uh, noah protected all these eight things um, first of all genesis um, 68 says um, he found favor in the eyes of god how why he found favor first of all because he is righteous um, and have good fellowship with god that's what genesis 69 says noah was a righteous man blameless among the people of his time and he walked faithfully with god um, and noah had three sons um, see he has he is a family man don't think that he is not at all doing sin he is um, doing sin but every time he do something he come to god repent um, and um, he try to live a righteous life um, blameless life a faithful life a righteous man blameless faithful that is what is needed um, that's why when great problem is going to come to attack the whole world only this nova one family was protected um, so the third thing what is happening is um, god instructed him to build the ark um, god told him there is going to be rain in his life he didn't see the rain at all but he didn't fear uh, he didn't doubt god he believed god uh, and by faith noah when warned about things not yet seen in holy fear build an ark to save his family that is what is needed you need a holy fear in your life um, to save your family you need a holy fear without holy fear you cannot save your family by his faith he condemned the world and became the heirs of the righteousness that is in keeping with faith um, he is a man and who kept faith them he became heir of righteousness and he with the holy fear he protected his family are you doing it that is very very important the next thing noah was about noah he is um, um, lives in the midst of corruption you cannot tell to god if the people around me are very bad they didn't allow me to pray they didn't allow me to preach the gospel as they were very corrupt i became also corrupt this not this not happened in the life of noah noah was surrounded by people who are totally corrupt genesis 6:13 says so god said to noah i am going to put an to all, all people for the earth is filled with violence because of them i am surely going to destroy both them and the earth so make yourself an ark of um, a cypress wood make rooms in it and coat it with the pitch inside on out um, this how this is how you are to build it so god is telling it how to protect him because um, it he is going to put them in the water for more than um, 150 days um, so and until, until that time the water should not enter the boat for that god is telling to cover it with the pitch so each and every uh, information god is giving to protect him and uh, he small small information even that is so small for now but that is only going to it's going to be waterproof water is not going to come inside him in the, for you also god is um, uh, protect you like that even the, even you surrounded by him uh, so much of problem that problem should not come and attack your family god is going to protect it um, and god is going to ask him to build the ark um, with the obedience um, uh, uh, no uh, build the ark and um, protect his family and friends i told you um, relatives um, that's why i told him um, we have to protect our family and the friends and relatives um, here he cannot be able to protect the friends but they are very corrupt people but he protected his family hebrews 11 7 says him that uh, he is a man of faith um, and he totally protected his family and um, and, uh, and moreover he is a he is a man of uh, uh, he is a preacher of righteousness um, second second peter 2 5 says um, even though the, the world the world was going to be uh, uh, not going to escape from the god's wrath um, but um, uh, god protected noah and his eight uh, relatives and his eight uh, family members um, and he was a man who preached righteousness um, among the people who are godless um, so we are also have to call them to preach the gospel we should not waste our time even if we get the time or not we have to preach the gospel that's what the bible says um, because the days are so evil uh, and moreover he, he was preserved during the flood um, um, even uh, the, therefore god told him uh, god remembered um, uh, after 150 days god remembered noah and family and the animal inside the uh, boat and he made uh, the wind to blow and, and that's why the flood is uh, the flood to stop them and noah and his family were protected and they were um, they were uh, they were guarded by god um, and the last thing is notable thing in this stream i told you that his we have a good name we should have a protect our name noah protected his name because um, ezekiel in chapter 14 14 says um, even though uh, the the god there are three people now like noah daniel and you job um, they can only save themselves um, and not other people so that much problem is facing here that's what um, the ezekiel said in genesis in genesis chapter 14 so um, 
the, the job was um, so no noah was included them um, as a righteous man along with daniel and um, job um, so that much he, he he preserved his name so what about you are you ready to do uh, preserve protect all the eight things in your life um, um, then you find favor with the god um, then you if you have a good relationship and fellowship um, god will certainly protect you from whatever the problems you are facing i want to pray for you thank you lord thank you for revealing this thing my lord help us to protect all, all these things what you have said in the name of jesus amen god bless you